He had enough. He had enough. Vince McMahon has retired. He had enough of this investigation. They must have had some dirt on him. They must have revealed some disturbing news about him. And he, you know, he wanted to save face by retiring. Yes, Vince McMahon has retired from WWE. What a day in wrestling history. This is Mark Hill's world, all things professional wrestling in my life. Like this video. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel. You are hearing it right, Vince McMahon. He has retired. That must mean that they had a lot of evidence on him that made him retire because we know that Vince McMahon, he has a huge ego and he wouldn't retire if they didn't have anything on him. So I guess maybe this was a mutual decision with the board for him to step down, which he's, you know, he stepped down and retired. So we won't, we probably won't ever find out what they, um, the investigation discovered. If we probably, it probably was an agreement. You step down and we will keep the record sealed and we won't tell the public what really happened. That is probably what the case is. This is a sad day for a lot of wrestling fans who grew up with Vince McMahon because they are huge fans of him. You know, to some people, he's like a father to them because they are so used to seeing him for all these years. We do see that Triple H, he, he is back with talent relations. He is back. A lot of people are saying that he's going to take over NXT. I don't believe that, but he is back in power, Stephanie McMahon is announced that she has a huge announcement. Yes, Stephanie McMahon has a huge announcement. She will be the one that opens up SmackDown. I wonder what she's going to say. She's going to be emotional or she's going to act like he just retired just because. And she's going to try to save face as well. She's not going to reveal what was discovered. She might, but um, I do like the McMahon family. I, I am sad about what what is happening, you know, his private life should be his private life, but I don't know if he mistreated people. I don't know, if, you know, if it has anything to do with rape, which I don't think he did, but if he um did harm somebody, then shame on him. But, you know, if he was having affairs, that, that, that should be, you know, between him and his family, him and his wife, matter of fact, but who's taking this some the hardest is Brock Lesnar. He is throwing a hissy fit. Allegedly, he's throwing a hissy fit. He is throwing shit all over. He is mad. He walked out of SmackDown because he is upset. He is upset about what happened with Vince McMahon retiring. So, you know him and Vince McMahon, they have a close relationship. They've been working together for years. Yes, they've been working together for years. And this is some shocking news. And you know, once, you know, sometimes with shocking news, your natural reaction, you can't control your natural reaction. So maybe he, he just walked out. And I wonder if they're going to call him unprofessional. We all know they called Sasha Banks and Naomi unprofessional for walking out. Is it the double standards? Is it the same when it's a male? We will see. Is that what Stephanie McMahon's going to announce? How unprofessional Brock Lesnar is? We doubt it. We doubt it. But yes, um, it's not the first time we heard news about Brock Lesnar. Remember when we saw footage of him throwing the title at Vince McMahon? So he is used to getting his way, which isn't nothing bad. And I'm not being negative towards him. I'm a huge fan of his. I remember him from the good old days of SmackDown. Uh, he was my favorite character on SmackDown, Here Comes the Pain. But, you know, this is some devastating news to a lot of the talent that grew up with, you know, that, you know, Vince McMahon helped a lot of these talents shape the person they are today. And, you know, he had definitely helped Brock Lesnar. So, oh, gosh, this is sad news. Vince McMahon has retired. This is Mark Hill's world, all things professional wrestling in my life. Like this video. Yes, like this video and subscribe. I post at least three times a week, and I will try to figure out what exactly is going on. So if you want to get the juice, the gossip, this is the place, wrestling gossip. See ya.